Good morning, guys. Welcome back to The Weiss Life. We are going to be doing some fun stuff for the baby today. Doctor visit. I don't visit. know if it's fun. He's well, kind of fun. So yesterday, Get him checked out. we took him to the ER per the advice of the um, discharging pediatrician at the hospital. His numbers for his Billy Rubin look good, which is like the jaundice thing they yeah. test for. Um, still high, but like they weren't any higher, which is really good. So this is just his like normal baby first doctor's appointment. Yeah. Except it is a little late because we were at the hospital for so long. Let's see how he's doing. How's he doing, Gabrielle? He's doing good. He's just waking up. He's being cute. He's so cute. So we're just gonna move his car seat. We're gonna, well, we're gonna buckle him. Um, and we gotta head out because the appointment's in like 20 minutes. First doctor's visit. Doctor time. All right, man, time to get up on the table. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let's right, let's get some little metrics on you, buddy. He's like, Mom, I can smell you. We'll show your sisters how tall you are, and you guys have to guess how old, or how old, <laughs> guess how old he is. You have to guess how much he weighs, and how tall he is. All right, boo, he's like, I'm close, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Yeah, the nurses and Hi, doctors Dad. at the hospital were shocked that he didn't lose weight. Yeah, that is amazing. So let me just, um, I'm going to measure his head and get okay. his temperature. Okay. You can see he has a little hematoma. Yeah, that was one of his boo-boos. Uh, during delivery? They think yeah. so, yeah. yeah. As soon as we saw him, he had it, so. <laughs> yeah. He had a way to rough, You're doing good, rough labor in delivery. I know when my second one came out, I thought she had two heads. Yeah, and then he had to go Seriously. to NICU for a little bit, so. 98.4, that's perfect. Good, I'm good job, buddy. his head real quick. Really just... All right. Um, you can, yeah. Okay. I don't know if I'm good at guessing head circumference. Yeah. Maybe like. Okay, sweet boy. Oh, wait. oh look at your cute little head. 13? Is that a weird <laughs> guess? No, that's good. 13's a good yeah, guess? that's a good guess. Okay, buddy. Whoa, Dad. Is yeah. right? About 13 and a quarter. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Good job. Good guess. Oh, I, I'll try harder next time, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so go ahead and remove the blanket. Okay. okay. Let me see how long you are. You were 19 when you so were mom, born. So, Mom, I'm going to have you scoot him up. Have his head touching the very top plastic piece there. Touch All right, All right, time to so guess So just his, hold it because I'm going to stretch height, down here. His, his height, height, yeah. Come on. You can eat in one minute. Oh, yeah. Good job. He's right at 19. Oh, that's exactly the same as uh, I Go ahead and pick that up. Good job, buddy. Oh, goodness. All right. So when the scale says zero, zero, go Oops, ahead and lay him. No, you're good. Lay him down and take his diaper off. Okay. All right. Do a little modesty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, zero, zero. You can put him down and take his diaper off. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Let's take that off. Mom's taking off the diaper. Oh, oh, and of course it gets it on him. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. okay. Look at you. You're almost wow. there. Oh, yay. Yay. You did great, right. buddy. Wow. Don't be sad. You did awesome. Oh. You're doing so great. You're doing so great. Oh, you are growing so good. My goodness gracious. Oh, you're being good now. He's hungry. He's like, okay, diapers back on. Oh, I think I know what's going him. on. I'm so glad he's keeping doing me. well. He's doing great. I'm so excited that he gained so much weight. I can't believe it. it's like 11 ounces in a week, less than a week. He's doing so good. He's doing well. He's still covered in boo boos. He's got a lot going on that he's trying to work out this week. But um, the doctor, or the nurse, the nurse said that they can hold off on doing his um, vaccinations until his next appointment. So hopefully he'll feel a little bit better so he's not like overwhelmed, which I think is a really good idea. Yeah, can you believe that I guessed the head? I don't even know, where'd you pull that number out of? Like, Well, I was just thinking, so circumference is like, I know it sounds silly, are usually bigger than you think. You're like, oh, he's got such a little head. But then I was like, all right, a foot? Okay, kind of maybe a little <laughs> bigger than that. Right, because you got to go all the way around. But that was a that was an awesome. Guess. I wouldn't have guessed that he does because I think he would have guessed like that. six. Right, I would have been like, he's so tiny. <laughs> he's doing so good. He hasn't opened his eyes a lot. But they usually don't do it unless it's dark. Okay, good. You've got one eye. Come on. But yeah, he's got a great suck. And you said he's been. He knows he needs to be at the ninetieth percentile. Right. So. He's he's aggressively trying to catch up. I am. Actually, I'm gonna take that out. He's like, wait a minute, that was delicious. 
heart sounds perfect. Yeah, there's no jaundice in his eyes whatsoever. And you made a big pee just as you were eating. Are you emptying your belly so that you have more room for food? Oh. He's really good at tummy time. Does he do great on chest to chest? Look at this. He does. He, oh, yeah. Look at that. <laughs> a little frog. So yeah, he's definitely old enough to do tummy time. And if we recommend doing a little bit every day. Oh, look at that little frog dance. So the thing is, it is just one, it gives him something else to do. You can see how he's moving in a different way than he would move on your uh, chest to chest. <laughs> Two, no one wants to be on the back all day. Okay. And then it helps with his head shape and just helps him like, learn how to push himself up yeah. how to move how to like how to move on a flat surface so like things like that <laughs> how to do and so yeah and it's good just to do that just kind of helps with the development okay. um so you can just do it here and there sometimes the belly button oh, does fall off again? here you go your one foot two foot you're gonna show off again okay now he's resting <laughs> Yeah, he, he did three big pushes and he's like, I'm now, now he's trying to eat his hands. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, so you can play with it. Um, I'm not worried if the umbilical cold fell off because it's going to fall off now or later. Um, but usually if it's, if it's going to fall off, it's going to fall off. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you can see how he's trying to move his head. Yeah. He, yes, he did a face plant. That's part of a learning experience. Oh, yeah. But that's why you just kind of have to watch him to make sure he can still breathe. And yeah. then he, he face planted and then he moved his head. So he knows what he's doing. Yeah. So yeah, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. He's learning how to spread his legs, stuff like his that. His legs are so teeny. I know. No, don't worry. If he's eating the way he is, give it a, give it two weeks. If he eats the way he is, he's gonna be fantastic. That a boy. Um. So yeah, and then the hematoma, and then everything else feels good. Yes, we can see that that does go away. Okay. Um. And then so no more bilirubin's needed. So he's looking fantastic. Um. Call us if you have any questions. If he does have a fever, I mean, kids under two months old, um, we really do want to know about every single fever. Oh, yeah, sure. Only because, like, your older kid could probably sit on a sign infection or an ear infection for a week and be honestly just fine. Yeah. Kids like yeah. him, with them being so small, um, if they have an ear infection, we want to catch it, like, Immediately. right away. Okay. So, yeah, call us even if it's at 2 a.m. if he has a fever over 100.4. And then just keep on, you said you're breastfeeding? Yes. Keep on breastfeeding because it seems like he's not having no issues with that one. No, he's, he's, <laughs> he's doing a good little eater. Okay. So everything went pretty well. Hey, it take did. take your mask off, Batman. Oh. <laughs> we just got to the car. He, I'm so glad that he's doing well. I was a little surprised. Like we knew he was small, but I didn't realize like on the percentile thing that he was like that small. Yeah. I don't know. And and you might be wondering, hey, why are you in the back seat? Uh, because he's only five days old and, and normally he wouldn't be traveling. <laughs> normally we're not going to take him anywhere. So, you know, she's there in case she starts choking or I don't know what, literally Just anything. Just to make sure he's covered with blankets yeah. and yeah, I, I feel it more comfortable doing that. I feel like a lot of people do that. I'm not the only one that writes. No, I don't know. I just find it sweet. for a couple weeks. It's I probably sweet. will. I don't know. I just worry. I'm worried about him. Heading into Target quick. Got a couple things we need for mom and the baby. So do it some Target. So basically we needed to come here today because um, the baby is completely out of preemie sized diapers and all of the stores like closer to our house were sold out of diapers too. Like, I don't know if there's like a diaper shortage going on or whatever, but like for some reason, preemie size and newborn size diapers are really hard to find. And I went on the Target app and I saw that this store had some. So they actually have this kind. And I grabbed three packs of them because I don't want to take them all just in case there's like another family like us that needs preemie diapers and I'm gonna hope that that's enough and maybe the one um, the store closer to us gets them in soon and then also something that we found I'll show you guys because fourth of July is coming up um, I got a newborn size but like look how cute this is so I'm thinking maybe he could wear this for fourth of July and I got all these shirts for the girls super cute right how's he doing Good, I found a hat. First trip to Target. Oh, that's like a dad hanging out in the pool hat. <laughs> hey, is there a print underneath it? Yeah. Stop, stop. Does it say Corona on it? Yeah. So you're getting that, right? It's already mine. <laughs> so I saw these dresses on TikTok and there were people like trying them on and it's kind of hilarious. Like, like look is, at these prints. What is this? Like what is going on here? I guess it's kind of fun, but like, is there is there such thing as too much same, fun? Are we looking at the same thing? Like, look at like take another look at this. Like, yeah, back up so you give it the full. Like, it's a bold move, Cotton. I, I actually feel like this is like a costume for like St. Patrick's Day. Oh, that could like, work. Like, could this be like a St. Patrick's Day costume? 
probably gonna grab some cereal quick because we always eat a ton of cereal really fast. Like you could always. probably know like one box of cereal is is, is a one meal, but like like not this. Like we would need two of those. Like this size. Like the family size. <laughs> Like two of those would be like one meal. Yeah. And I was just telling Melissa, I think it's movie night because I just watched most of the Marvel movies with like Thor and Hulk and all that oh, with the girls. Awesome. And today they're releasing the Loki movie, which is supposed to be like really good. Well, the Trickster be good because God. The baby and I are really tired. This going up to the doctor, like we've only been at Target for like 30 minutes and I'm already tired and done walking for the day. But I guess, I mean, like, he's less than a week old. Like, so we're still recovering. Yeah. I'm still covered in, let me show you guys. I have, like, bruises from, like, IVs and, like, the sticky tape on oh, me yeah. still from the hospital. Yeah, yeah, Like, we're just taking it day by day here. Day by day by day. We did get a little bit extra sleep last night um, because... Yeah, we had a great strategy. Uh, Jeff, get out of here. <laughs> so, the baby... So we have a... Well, oh, go ahead. We have a big cushion top, like six inches of foam so when i lay in it it creates like a thing so if i get out then there's room for the docket so i can breastfeed and stuff in there the docket can fit in the bed so yeah yeah so he got to sleep he got a full night's sleep so he slept in one of the girls rooms yeah. and then the baby and i had the whole bed to ourselves with his little little sleeper bassinet thing and we did pretty well i mean it, I, it, it worked out great i went in and uh gretchen and gwen of course were sleeping so i I was like, Gretchen. She goes, what? I was like, you sleep with Gwen? She's like, yeah. Of course. I went over to Gwen, like Gwen, Gretchen's gonna say, okay. And they kind of snuggled in there and I was like, all right. So he, like, was, he was on a twin bed all night, but it worked out. It was I mean, good. But I think I'm gonna try to get home today and we're gonna take a nap. Like, like I said, I'm really tired. Little man's still out from his appointment. I'm really glad that you didn't get shots. Oh, I just jinxed it. Did you hear him? Yeah, I think he's, let's see. Let's see extreme close up. Oh, he's wiggling. He's so cute. He's wiggling. Maybe we'll get him. Let's 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 get him out of here. Let's go back home and check in, everybody. We're gonna check out. We got a full cart full of stuff. I can never leave Target without stuff that I didn't plan on buying. We also got some stuff for the girls, uh, some clothes and stuff for them to try on. For some reason, the Target that we're at today is not our regular one. They have like a way bigger selection of swimsuits, dresses, kids' clothes. So I just kind of guessed on some of the sizing because the kids have all been going through growth spurts, but I figure whatever doesn't work, we'll just take it back to yeah, our local it'll store. Work. It'll work. Um, and I got 4th of, of July shirts, which, did I show you guys? Uh, I'm so brain Spoiler, you have to check out Instagram. Yeah, Instagram. We're gonna do some cute little 4th of July pictures and I think the girls are really gonna like them. So definitely go over there if you wanna check it out. We're home now yeah. and the girls immediately ran over to check in on the baby. Can you help me carry some stuff in quick? We yeah. got a bunch of stuff at Target. I know. He's so cute. So the doctor says he's gained a little bit of weight. He's looking real good, healthy. And he went shopping at Target for the first time. So <laughs> it was fun. He was good. So what? Cool. What? Oh, that's beautiful. You made that today? Yeah. I love it. I made it for you and the baby. Do you want to put it on the wall here with the other art things that you made? Yeah. Let me put it on. It's beautiful. So it's 340. And I feel like we're kind of winding down. Melissa and Jagger are upstairs. Now, I'm sure you understand that, what is today? The 9th, the 10th? He's like five days old. So really, Melissa especially. Um, but Melissa and I haven't really slept in like the last, I don't know, several days. But uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll keep you up to date with everything going on with Jagger and the girls and Melissa and I, and we really appreciate you guys watching, and we will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.